Hello, Anson Griffin here again with another YouTube tutorial featuring MATLAB. Today is the 15th of April 2020 and this is video number 253, 253. So today, just not my own work. So MATLAB Find Exchange and analysing traffic using a webcam, Raspberry Pi and ThingSpeak. So I assume you know a fair bit and the staff, I think, wrote this one. And you can read that there if you are new to things speak and they do the setup. So they have a camera there in Massachusetts looking at wherever that highway is and they're looking at eastbound traffic and westbound traffic. And you can see there if you want to read that they do there some object detection just to count the cars. But we're just looking at the things speak there and they give here um, an M file. Now, just to be aware, that if you're doing this in TinSpeak, you can download it there. Download it there and you can run it in MATLAB itself. But when you run it in TinSpeak, you run into a few problems. So that's just to give them the credit. And there is their version of the traffic monitor. And that's the MATLAB thing speak 38629. So I did some graphs based on what they did there. There's the four graphs. So I'm just to briefly run over just to give you some idea. If I do it in detail, I'll be here for all day. So the one thing when you go back to here, the example, you can just run it in one go. And you'll get a couple of graphs at the end. There's graph one, graph two, graph three, graph four. So, but when you're doing it in ThingSpeak, you have to do one visualization per graph. Well, at least I had to do it that way. So you have to break up the code into four different uh, visualizations. So there's just a general one there. I'm, I suppose by rights I should go through it line by line, but I'm not going to. There, there they are. They're reading in that channel, three eight six two nine. And there's a plot, and I'll just give you that one there. Okay. Next one up. This is the eastbound traffic. Just go slowly down there. And I made one or two changes here. Um, here you just want to get an exact integer seven because remember you want to do it in seven days. So I did a mod there, so I got the remainder. So I divided um, 39546 that gives you 5649 and I wanted to floor it so what I wanted to do was I got the mod that I think would give me a remainder three and then what I did was I removed the first three elements of of all traffic data that thing there makes it blank or voids it or deletes it so I'd get it exactly integer seven he does it slightly differently there he floors it so the length divided by seven and then you floor it and you floor it I mean I guess there'd be a remainder but when you floor it you, sorry rephrase that again you divide it by seven you get end up with nine thousand point three four but when you say floor you end up with nine thousand so you divided that data up there into seven days you'll have to look it up yourself and when you plot it there, uh, there, there it is there, you get the eastbound traffic per day. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You do the same, that's for, oh sorry, that's the raw sample one, sorry, that's the wrong one. A 
that's the eastbound and I have the daily mean west calculated daily mean west calculated but I did that I didn't plot it here because I could only get one graph to go per visualization so what I had to do was do another visualization basically copy and paste the same code is that the right one no wrong one here sorry westbound you can see there I copied and pasted the east traffic and I just removed the east traffic and then well I calculated the daily mean east but I only plotted the daily mean west west and then finally the different days per week is there and we we only did I only did one day because I could only knock out one plot per visualization so you'd have to do it from Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday you'd have to do seven different visualizations and maybe there's some way of doing seven figures in one but I can't figure that out I only can only do one plot or one figure per visualization sorry that the voice is a little hoarse and thanks very much for listening and I hope that helps a little